At the moment, I'm sitting just above 10,000 feet above sea level. Right behind me is Crater Lake, and behind the lake, the Maroon Bells, the iconic peaks that rise just above 14,000 feet, right outside the town of Aspen. Every time I come to cover the Aspen Music Festival and school, I'm keenly aware of this sharp dichotomy between these extremes of civilization and nature. On the one hand, Aspen is an extravagantly worldly town. The most fashionable and expensive designer shops line the streets. At the same time, there are foxes and wolves and moose wandering the hills just outside of town or even sometimes right through town. You can have a delicious gourmet $200 meal and if you don't finish it, a black bear might clean up your scraps in the garbage right out back later that same evening. Some people, though, choose to immerse themselves in the nature that surrounds Aspen. Go for long hikes in these hills, even climb the peaks behind me. Of course, that comes with a certain amount of risk. People get lost on long hikes. Thunderstorms can hurl hail or even lightning down at you. But if you choose to immerse yourself in that and deal with those risks, face them head on, it can be such a nourishing and enriching experience. Sharpen your perspective and then you bring that back to everyday life. I think we can choose to experience music in similar ways. For some people, music is a pretty background, a pleasant hum while our attention is focused someplace else. But if you choose to immerse yourself in music, It can be so deeply enriching. If you open your heart and soul to that, it can surprise you. You might find yourself feeling with a lot more intensity, love and loss, sympathy and sweetness, pain even, emotional pain. But that sharpness of feeling is so beautiful and rich, and you bring that back to the rest of your life and to everything you do. Nature and music, neither is easy. Both come with some risks if we choose to open ourselves fully to them. Both, though, can change you in unexpected ways. And both are in abundance here in and around Aspen, Colorado. Mm 